how to get the most out of your A-level maths and further maths past papers. As someone who got 100% on every single paper in both maths and further maths. So before you even start doing past papers for maths or further maths, what you want to do is create a list of every single topic in your specification for the paper you want to start practicing and then write down how comfortable you are with each of the, these topics. For any topics that you're not comfortable on, what you want to do is then open up YouTube and watch as many videos as you need until you understand the topic and then go on Physics and Maths Tutor or Maddus Maths and do six to eight practice questions for that topic once you've done that and you feel comfortable with that topic, you can then tick it off. You want to slowly do this and work through each topic in your specification so you're comfortable with every single one of them before you even start doing past papers. Once you start doing past papers, you want to be marking them as harshly as possible. So any questions where you're not sure if you'd get the mark or not, don't give yourself the mark because it's better now for you to mark yourself down for being sloppy so you remember not to do it rather than marking you down in the exam and then you missing the grades you need because of it. After you've marked the paper, go through every question you've got wrong, then look at the solutions from the mark scheme and try to understand how to solve the question and see where you went wrong. And don't consider the question completed and done with until you can get a new piece of paper, hide the mark scheme and do the question from scratch and solve it for full marks. And this doesn't count if you've looked at the mark scheme so many times, you just remember all the steps. <laughs> if that's the case, write it down on your notes. I, I do it on my phone personally, and then come back to that question in a few days and see if you can solve it then. Once you've done that for every single question that you got wrong on the paper, you can consider that the paper completed with and move on to the next one. This is really important that you go through the steps of looking at the questions you got wrong and then deeply understanding how to solve it and then being able to solve it from scratch about the mark scheme because that's where the most of your improvement from doing past papers actually comes from.